Oh. <laughs> you know what? What the hot guys so Trust me, do you want to see a um, guy? I'm gonna show you all the video Is he adorable, guys? Is he adorable? Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, what up, what up? Welcome to another vlog. And as I always say, I thank you guys for taking the time to tune into my channel. Because you been, could have been doing anything else in the world, but you chose and decided to watch me. Um, and hopefully I can keep those things entertaining for you so that as you're watching, you're not just bored can be dry we're gonna keep it entertaining but uh hope you guys are well today uh, i feel like i have some stuff that's going on that potentially entertaining the first thing not so much um the first thing is just me vacuuming out my vacuuming out my car cleaning my car because it has to be done you know what i mean that's what men do they take care of their stuff so that you can maintain it and, and have it over a long period of time but i'm doing it because my sons just have no respect for what is mine when i tell you to have no respect when you see this back seat and the floor the disrespect is just getting out of hand so i got to take care of that today staining my leather messing it all up like look at my look at my floor jesus look at my floor oh my gosh look at my floor i ain't even moved life since life is the main one that eats everything so i'm gonna knock that out clean up the seat the car all of that sort of stuff and then i want to hit this um sneaker drive i have some shoes that i want to drop off but it might be a little too late because i think the deadline submission for the sneakers were yesterday so i'm gonna see if my boy will let me drop some stuff off after that i think i want to hit deco just to sit around chill lounge hopefully they got the outside open so that's a nice little vibe sit down eat some food in the weather watch a game or some sports but i also think i want to film some b-roll for the documentary that i'm shooting around town so i'm probably go downtown and all that stuff and most likely film some b-roll so that's the plans that we have today but what i'm gonna do right now and just jump to it nice little chill day out here i promise y'all you give me some good music nice day nice weather I can sit outside for hours be out here all day long i'm enjoying myself i don't have to go nowhere i'm just eating up and it's cool got the burgers on the grill uh, hot dog and stuff on the grill and all that too people enjoying themselves grabbing their sneakers Nice little shoe drive, nice day. This one is the other ones. Um, so I think some of the other ones ain't what because you gotta buy the case for it. I think this one. What up, what up, what up, ladies and gentlemen? Obviously, the shoe drive is done. Nice little day I spent over there. I got there maybe around 12 12 30 and uh, finish helping them set up, break down, all of that sort of stuff. That's what I do. That's my that's my spiritual gift is service. So I don't feel right if I don't help somebody clean up and all that sort of stuff. But excuse me, that's what I did. Help clean up, help take some stuff to the dump. Ran over here real quick to swish. Delaware Ave, Deco. Deco is right there, that building. <clears throat> but you know what I had to do when I went to Deco is visit 
the chicken and waffle spot. I was filling for some chicken and waffles and I got ended up getting the red velvet chicken and waffles. Let me show y'all this red velvet chicken and waffles. I'm telling you, when I tell you, bruh, them chicken, red velvet chicken and waffles. Now the chicken was on a little crispy side, you know what I mean? Like, if you're having chicken and waffles, you want that, you know, nice crispiness on the outside, but you still want the inside to be juicy, but they kind of burnt the outside a little bit, therefore overcooked the chicken on the inside a little bit. But your boy was hungry, so I wasn't even tripping about it. But let me show y'all the chicken and waffles that I ate. The red velvet drum was great. When I say, you need to try it, go try it. Bang! Y'all see this? Y'all see the remnants? Your boy crushed those chicken waffles, all right? I'm sorry that y'all getting, I didn't even think to show y'all before I, before I decided to eat them. Cause I was just that hungry. I haven't eaten anything since like, about 11.30, 12 o'clock today. And it's, a, it's about 5.30, so your boy was hungry. But when I say them chicken waffles was great, they were great. So if you're in the Delaware area, I mean, a lot of people have heard of Deco already, but if you have not heard of Deco, make sure you go visit Deco. Um, but what I'm doing right now is kind of feel inspired, Joe, looking at this Delaware Ave in the sunset and the sun that I have. I think I want to pull out my camera and, and um, shoot some B-roll footage uh, of this particular street, and, and we'll use that in the documentary that I'm doing on fashion. Let me just want to show y'all the skyline and what it looks like. So you have this nice, you probably can't see it up top because of the lighting, but nice sunset backdrop up there you can see at the top of the building it's kind of dimly lit down here shaded from the sun then in the distance you have a little bit of that uh sun on the buildings back that way and then it's just this nice street with tall buildings decent for like b-roll footage now granted this is something as you transition and you want to add that into excuse me add that into the documentary as a transition into the next clip or next scene or something like that so i think we'll get some b-roll footage and, and call it push that way so first time you guys might have seen me here in this vlog before you've you've probably met my homeless counterpart his name is also Brandon but I am as Steve Ur as Stefan is to Steve Urkel I am Brandon as to Brandon so you know she check me out huh got the little cut my goodness brought me back I was needing it thank you Jesus Again, it's just I always tell people it's something about a fresh cut to make a man feel a certain kind of way. All right. Now, what I'm going to do, Joe Budden, he had a comment talking about some cheating ain't the man's fault, it's the barber's fault. Where they get that from? Where they do that at? Self control, my brother. But nah, I definitely feel like, you know, boost of confidence when you look good, got your hair cut, all of that sort of stuff. But again, at the end of the day, self control. We all grown men out here. But yeah, sure, got my hair cut. Um, now, next things we're gonna do, hit the gym. Gotta hit the gym, get the swole on really quick. Go back to the cribbo. After we hit the cribbo, cook some dinner. Then uh, send a couple emails, cause I'm gonna be uh, recruiting for my team and doing a little, um, hosting a information session to be for folks to be part of the team. Announce a little bit of what I got going on and would like to do with Delaware Fashion Lines. Um, I'm going to give you guys some more insight into that also um, when I kind of finalize some of the details. Um, but yeah, that's what we got going on, man. Real chill evening. Gym, home, emails, and probably editing a couple of other vlogs. I've been stalking a different kind of dimension. Yup, with another way alive, where there's only one nation. Huh? No ego, no racist, no hating. Only good vibes, always making sure we celebrate them. What's up, Trust? Hi. Say hi. Hi. Today, Trust and I are embarking on our journey of his 9.30 a.m. cardiology appointment. So we got to take him into his appointment at AI. Um, I 
then I'm dropping them right back off at school because I have to go continue working and do a bunch of other stuff um, today. Today's Wednesday, and, and my, my Wednesday's kind of crazy. A little busy today. Um, but nonetheless, we're going to knock it out because that's what I do. You know what I'm saying? But first things first is we got to make our way on over to Chick-fil-A to grab some breakfast really quick because probably won't have a chance to eat until about lunchtime. Um, could I have a name for your order? Um, yeah, Brandon. I have a mobile order, but I also needed to place an additional order. I got you. I'll get the mobile one real quick. And then, what is the other order? Can I have an order for, uh, of uh, a s small cookies and cream milkshake? That's it? Uh, yeah. Can I have that um, in like two cups, like one cup? Because he likes to poke a hole in the cup. So I like to. So you just want like an empty cup on the side? Yeah. I got you. And then um, no whipped cream, no cherry. And then like a flat cap that go on like a regular soda cap, beverage cap. Oh, uh, you gotta start with that car. Alright, we got our food. Now we're on the way. Flying on the road though. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We are done with our appointment for the day and uh, get ready to load this kid back in the car and head on home. Good trust? Yeah. Yeah. You ready to go to daycare? Yeah. Have fun? Did you have fun at your doctor's appointment? Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right now. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, so I'm at Iron Hill Brewery. As you can see, the spread of food that we had got, that we have gotten, and this food is slapping on all levels. I'm talking about everything. I ain't taste nothing that didn't taste good yet. I had Brussels sprouts. I haven't eaten Brussels sprouts in forever, and they were good. This one, so they were good too. Everything good? Yeah. What you like the best? Circle the whole plate. <laughs> the whole plate. My man said everything on the whole plate was good, Dad. So everything has been good. Like the chicken tenders, Brussels sprouts. We got a sampler. So we got the Philly cheesesteak egg roll, then the buffalo chicken egg roll, quesadilla, and um, then we also had some uh, warm croissants. A1. Definitely not disappointed. Y'all saw the plate, y'all saw everything that was on there. So. I don't even know what to say. I'm lost for words right now. What you think, Trust? What you think? Trust. What you think? Yeah. Nothing else to say. What are you doing, sir? <laughs> what are you going to dip your quesadilla in? What kind of sauce? It tastes bad. Eat it. It tastes bad, Dad. You'll find out. Eat it. Tell me what you think. A little bit good. A little bit? Uh-huh. What does it taste like? Sour cream punch. Sour cream punch? Yeah. Get the one over here. Good job. Come over here, buddy. It's not these silly boys. That's not a D silly boy. 
What's your plan now? You got it. Okay, what's the letter is that? K. Good job, sir. Where's the K? That's an H. Alright, this one over here. This one over here, look. Good job. Found it. What up, Kim Folk? Just want to jump on here real quick because uh, I got some mentioning going on. I actually have a photo shoot this evening uh, that I kind of actually forgot about. Photo shoot at my crib. I turned my little crib space into a um, full-blown studio uh, so what I'm doing right now is setting up sorry cuz uh, the shoots at 7 p.m. is currently 533 I got to set up everything really quickly as Ken and then shoot over to Home Depot because I need to get some uh, either glass or a whiteboard or something to lay down on top of the white seams paper so heels don't poke a hole through it so what I'm gonna do is show you guys the time-lapse of me setting up then I head to Home Depot and then we're gonna get the shoot cracking I do not care if you reach your port. Don't give a damn what you can't afford. Doesn't matter what you're putting on. Put your pride on Louis Vuitton. Got an Apple One on Android. As long as you pick any time I call. Long as you go my back when I fall. And be the person to count on. Doesn't matter where you went to college. Or whether you never got to finish. It doesn't define. Doesn't mean a thing. I make my rules. I look like a king. Like Plexiglass. Found it. Perfect, right? This size, 96 by 48. Would be perfect. But guess how much that costs? Ain't no way in the world, folks. Ain't no way in the world. So I'm gonna take my, I'm gonna take my behind on over here back to this other section where I found some whiteboard. I'm gonna load that on up on the car because the whiteboard was eighteen dollars per section. Ideally, I would have loved to have a plexiglass, but I'm not about to pay two hundred thirty-nine dollars per sheet for plexiglass. And I need two, at least like two sheets of that. It's not gonna work. Not for the pockets. We're not right now. Color may not be exactly what I would like, but it is what it is. We'll live with it. We'll, we'll make it work. So we find a cart and get up out of here as it is 627. Like I get back to the crib. I don't see race, yo. I don't see colors. I don't see face, yo. I don't see age, yo. I don't see status. I don't see weight, yo. I don't feel hate, yo. Only got love for all my hate. Thus, I stay in my lane. Cause I figured it out and I know you what the fuss. You ain't what the noise. Why do you raise your shoulders up? Say they make yourself. Put it create yourself. So why so proud? I don't think I'm special. I could dab in anyone. So I try to do anything that is best for all. Even if you miss, I take a loss. Cause I follow different kind of loss. I've been doing anything I want. I don't care what the people talk. On social media, I don't give up. I do not see your dimensions. Just checking in with y'all from yesterday. I was supposed to show you guys a bit of the shoot. However, battery was on. The battery was, the GoPro was dead, so I didn't really get a chance to film or any of the shoot that I did yesterday with my cousin. However, I think I may show you a couple of the final images right now. With another way alive, where there's only one nation. Huh? No ego, no racist, no hate. Huh? Only good vibes, always making sure we celebrate. Huh? So, those are some of the images from the shoot uh, that we did. And come on, man. I'm trying to talk. So, those are some of the images that we did from the shoot. And there's not too much more that I want to uh, pull up in this vlog. I'm going to start a new one because I feel like I've been showing y'all a whole lot and it's just been all over the place. So we're going to end this vlog right here. Um, and Life says he wants to show you his new sneakers. You want the Spider-Man sneakers? Yeah. Cool. Light up? Cool. 
But um, what I'm gonna do is we're gonna leave it all on that note, and I will catch you guys later. Again, as I always say, thank you guys for tuning in to watch my vlog because you could have done anything else with your time, but you chose to spend your time watching this vlog. So I'm greatly appreciative and I thank you. Um, have a wonderful evening, day, morning, whenever uh, you're watching this. Um, I hope you're enjoying yourself. Catch you later. Peace.